Good morning, people, and welcome to Stinky's Art Class, where we have the best students in the world. Today's lesson is how to draw rain. So let's jump right in and let's uh, draw some rain. So the first thing you want to do is you want to draw the rain clouds. Now these are going to be the fluffy rain clouds, right? And you can also do the, you know, the rain clouds like this, you know, more of the, you know, the rain clouds that are darker, kind of dark rain clouds. And these two rain clouds are about to collide and hopefully not create a tornado. We'll save that for another lesson. So you want to just kind of draw some, see, does that look like rain? Okay. And you can also do some raindrops. Yeah, that's kind of how I like to draw rain. There's lots of ways to draw rain. Everybody can draw it a little bit different. Okay. Now this one um, is going to be raining too. But it's, it's kind of... Yeah, raining all kinds of ways. You know, big raindrops. These are big rains. Okay, which one do you like better? Okay, I think I'm going to go with this one. This one's maybe uh, a little bit not good enough. So, you want to do what works for you. Sometimes, you know, you have to do your art two different ways to really decide which way is the best. Um, in this case, I think maybe this one's looking better. This one needs more work. And I just don't want to spend the time working on it because I'm happy with this one. But I'm glad I did the exercise to test it, you know, to see what's better. So um, I would say, you know, class, just keep testing your art. Like, try try new things. Try to do things in a different way. And if you, you know, don't like that one, then you can always go back to your original. But, uh, you know, explore new ways to draw. And... Um, Keep up the good work, class. I know this is kind of a short lesson about drawing rain and not the most exciting, but we're going to have epic lessons coming up. Don't forget to watch our new lessons this week and uh, have a great day. Bye.